Hi, my name is Colby Sharp. I am a fifth grade teacher at Parma Elementary, and I'm really excited to talk to you today about Gordon Corman's Restart. Restart by Gordon Corman is about your stereotypical jock middle school boy who often doesn't make the right decisions. Uh, he falls off a building and has amnesia and gets a second chance at life and gets an opportunity to live in a different way. The beginning of the school year is a very special time and so many teachers that I know and myself included, we spend the summer trying to get refreshed and refocused, but also like what is going to be our first read aloud of the year? What is the book that we're going to kick off the year with? What is the book that is going to be part of our class canon? And I think Restart is the perfect book to kick off the school year. I think it's great. I think kids will love the characters. I think kids will love going back and forth with different uh, points of view. And I think that it's just a great way to build that classroom community. So one of the things that we spend a lot of time focusing in my classroom is character development development and helping my kids see how characters change over time and like let's be honest like a book about a character who has no idea who they are and then discovers who they were and is trying to figure out who they need to become is just a great example of characters and their growth that they can have over time so one way that i use this with kids if i'm reading it aloud or if i have kids reading it on their own we always look at the characters when you read a book like restart and you have a character like chase He's gonna really make kids think deeply about who they are. Uh, all of the readers in your room are gonna be doing the same thing that Chase is doing. They're gonna be reflecting on the life that they've lived, the choices that they've made, both the good and the bad and the ugly and, and how those affect who, affected who they are. So when I'm talking about this book with kids and we're reading it in class and we're stopping and we're discussing what's going on, so many kids are making those text to self connections because they are really relating. Gordon does an amazing job of making Chase a character that really Readers just can't help but root for it when they're thinking about what they would do in that situation. And they're going to be reflecting on their own decisions in life. And I think that's one thing that makes a book like this special. If we find ourselves to have to continue learning and teaching our kids virtually, I think it's important that we help them to see how big the world is because so often they're stuck at home. They're social distancing, they're following the rules, they can't go to school, they can't do a lot of the things that they love. So what I did with my students is every single day that we met in Zoom, I brought in a guest. And a lot of times I would find different authors who Skype for free with students. I find illustrators that Skype for free. I would also bring in doctors and lawyers and real estate agents. I think it's always important for kids to see all of the possibilities out there and let them decide what it is that they want to be passionate about and what they want to do and what makes them happy. Restart is a great book to read aloud to students anytime during the school year. My hope for my kids is that they will take away that it is never too late to become the person you want to be. My classroom and students loved it. I know you will too. Be sure to add it to your school, classroom, or home library.